What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and today I have a top five and basically this is a very versatile video. You don't have to be a sneakerhead. You don't even have to like shoes. This is basically what everyone should have. Starting things off with the first category is casual or lifestyle. So for my pick, I did choose the Vans old school. See this pair is kind of dirty, which I did wear these today. I have a couple pairs of these and they're really nice. Vans are just affordable, trendy shoe that you can buy almost anywhere and they're always accessible. So these are about 50 to $60. You can't go wrong. They match everything and you just can't wear these enough. They would pretty much make your fit stand out with whatever you are wearing and everyone knows these. Also in this category quickly, you can get the slip-ons. I do have them and also the authentics or the eras. I just don't have any pairs with me right now to show, but Vans are always a go-to. Coming right up next is the runner category. Now for this I have my Adidas Ultra Boost 1.0. Now I own like the 1.0 so I do wear these all the time. I had about five or six pairs total. In general, I have to say the 1.0 is my favorite and the white colorway is the nicest of them all. I pretty much beat these up and they're kind of my beater but that's a separate category. You'll see why later because this is technically a running shoe. Next up we have a pretty new category for sneakerheads because not a lot of them are into this stuff but I believe this is pretty important and it's the dress up or the boots category. Now I recently just switched it up a little bit and my style has changed from like basketball shoes. I really don't wear any basketball shoes anymore that consist of LeBrons or Kobe's or KD's or I really don't have any of those anymore. But I really want to give a big thanks to my grandma who actually did purchase these for me. They are from Zara Men and these are great great Chelsea boots. If you're not looking to spend like $500 and up for common projects and really high-end brands, these are crazy good quality and they fit amazing. I am going to get into more of styling with this, but it's a really nice casual boot that's that's wearable for any occasion and at the moment I don't really have a pair of dress shoes I recently got a new opportunity for a job that does require me to wear a more professional and formal look so I definitely will be picking up more shoes like that for right now I have this boot it's called a Chelsea boot from Zara next on the essentials list is a category that I just want to call the flex I'm joking guys but it's really more of a heater or a going out type category and for me personally I have the Mason Margiela's right here if you guys want to see the video where I did pick these up, make sure to go check my recent videos. But nonetheless, these are in my category because I really like how the way they stand out. They're not for an everyday use. And I didn't even get a chance to wear these yet since I did buy them. But if you guys take a look, this quality is insane. This is really good leather over here and the best suede of probably one of the best suedes I've ever felt on a sneaker. Hence why retail is so expensive. Coming up last but not least is my beater category. I have the Yeezy V2 in this beluga colorway. The only reason it's my beater is because I purchased it pretty worn, pretty used, and it has a lot of heel drag on it, and it's just dirty overall. It looks clean on camera because the upper is, but the bottom, guys, is pretty dirty. So I wear these all the time wherever I want to just, you know, wear something that's really, really comfortable and does stand out at the same time. probably one of my favorite Yeezys to ever release of like the version 2 so these are great and they're slowly turning into my beater hope you guys enjoyed my list and I really feel like everyone should have this you know it's 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 something that you need to have in your closet or wardrobe or collection whatever the case may be and I really feel like this video helped you guys a lot I hope it did make sure to drop a like down below 
I asked to get 50 likes on one of my videos and you guys killed it with over like 60. So really, really big thanks to that. Make sure to contact me on Snapchat and Instagram. I'm going to have both of them up on the screen right now. And I'm working on an intro and an outro so it's really clean and gives you guys a better look than just a black screen like I used to have it in the end. Two videos a week. Hope you guys enjoy that. Leave feedback down below. This is AM Sneaks and I'm out.